with hurricane season upon us. It's important to understand the categories of hurricanes and what that could mean for your home as they approach. Now, all hurricanes are rated on the Saffir Simpson scale, and this is a measure of its wind speeds and only its wind speeds. So category one, this is when you get dangerous winds with minimal damage. Winds are 74 to 95 miles per hour. You can expect seeing some damage to your roof with shingles coming off or some minor tree damage in your yard. Now, this was the category that Florence was back in 2018. Now, category two storm, this is when you start to see some more extreme winds with extensive damage. Wind speeds 96 to 110 miles per hour. You could start seeing some roadways getting blocked and some more tree damage as well as damage to your house. Now, category three storm, this is when we get into some major hurricane status. This is extreme winds 111 to 129 miles per hour. You're going to start seeing more damage to your house, the sides of it, as well as the roof, as well as power and electricity being out for days or weeks with a category three storm. Now, category four, this is extreme winds with catastrophic damage. Winds 130 to 156 miles per hour. This is what Hugo was when it made landfall back in 1989. Now, you could start seeing roofs fall apart and exterior walls coming apart from your house, as well as large trees being uprooted from the wind. Now, category five storm, this is 157 miles per hour or greater. All well-built homes aren't built to the test of these wind speeds and will all fall apart and it could take months or years to recover from this kind of storm. And while wind damage is the way we rate these storms, there are plenty of other dangers with them, including storm surge, flooding, and severe weather that all accompany these storms. So it's important to stay weather aware and updated no matter what kind of storm is headed your direction. For News 19, I'm meteorologist Danielle Miller.